Again meeting Johan Cruyff, the two skippers who met at Ellen Road a fortnight ago. So these then are the men who are holding the hopes of England really in their hands tonight at the end of May and Leeds in all white now kicking off attacking the goal to our left Barcelona in their familiar red and blue stripes and blue shorts Migreli it's a good ball there for Asensi played now for Naskins as Barcelona strike forward and Naskins with the shot and strike has to go down there again now Naskins Dutch World Cup player with a sweeping pass there to find Carlos Rexach well played by Frankie Gray De La Cruz a deep cross on the far side oh McQueen couldn't quite get to it and Barcelona very nearly nearly struck there good worry Hunter Towards Joe Jordan, a good leap there by Jordan. Now this could be the moment for Lorimer, yes! Peter Lorimer! Silence here in Barcelona. They're absolutely stunned by that goal. A beautiful goal for Leeds United. Scored superbly by Peter Lorimer. But made unquestionably for him by Joe Jordan. A great leap there by Jordan. And Lorimer took it beautifully in his stride past Stardoni and that's a tremendous breakthrough for Leeds well that really means in pure mathematics to win tonight Barcelona have got to score three played for a Sensi quite Clarence Cruyff again for Barcelona. That little bit of acceleration and there's the cross going in. And I think he's given a penalty. No, he hasn't. But now Mourinho as Barcelona push a lot of men forward. Towards Rexash. That's a good cross again by Rexash. And Cherry only gets it away there to Asensi. Heredia can't get anything. Asensi! Oh! Just over that Leeds bar. Rexash to Gallego. Played on for Naiskids again. Nicely running in there for Rexash. There's the shot. The shot and, it's and just over that Leeds United crossbar, there was a warning there. Now swinging it away for Gallego to Clares. It'll come through for Naiskins now for Barcelona. Nice little bit of play there for Clares. Hit in first time. Oh, and Hunter couldn't get to it, and neither could the. Uh, Barcelona player Cruyff right in there. De La Cruz leads under so much pressure now. It's with Cruyff. No, it's with Stewart. Now there's Cruyff again on the ball for Barcelona. Looking to get past Thierry and he succeeds. And Hunter got that on its way but only as far as Rexach. That's the corner. No, it's not good. There you go. To Niskins, a nice turn. Played again for Heredia. Hit by Paris! <laughs> his way, and what a good ball there by Terry Yoris to Peter Lorimer. Lorimer's gone past his man, Mourinho. There's the cross going in towards Joe Jordan, and it was uh, Migueli that got it away. But so too was De La Cruz. And it's a throw for Leeds. Well, Maitley's got in well behind that defence. Onto the roof of the net. Now it's Niskins for Barcelona. To Cruyff. Two of the men who appeared in that Dutch World Cup final. Cruyff again. Brought down by Hunter. So Hunter claims he was shamming. Cruyff says he wasn't. The referee says it's a free kick. 
and for good measure goes across to have a word with Norman Hunter about it as well. So Cruyff now, oh there's some pushing going on there and the referee getting in between them and Gray in all honesty was of course not getting further away from that free kick. Cruyff reacting badly and the crowd are beginning to hoot and whistle now. And with one of these Cruyff free kicks this could be danger for Leeds United. Six minutes to go to half time. There's the free kick. And in the end there was no danger as Joroth got it away. Cruyff again, a back heel and a cheeky one. Back for Cruyff again. Kick towards Naiskin and Asensi. And a shot there that only uh, hit Trevor Cherry from Clares. It's good enough for the referee to make a fuss about Leeds United getting 10 yards back. He must do the same for, for Barcelona. Nobody offside. And Lorimer is back to get hold of this one. Clark Ernie right out of his goal. Now can Lorimer do something with this as he's crossed in? Clark is right in there. Bremner on the far side. My goodness, that was really a terrible mistake by Barcelona. And Leeds very nearly. The wonderful trip at the end of the season. Rex Ash. Hurling and out of those crosses in. Clara's oh. got it but couldn't hit it in the right direction. Well, the crowd are getting impatient with Barcelona spraying those sort of passes about. They want them to come forward. And that's just what they're doing now with Mason. There's the shot. And a goal kick. I'll start again. So welcome back to Barcelona. Barcelona then now be kicking off, attacking the goal to our left, and they brought on a substitute, Rife, a fullback, into Barcelona. No, it's a throw. Well, they've sorted it out, and it's Peredio with the throw then for Barcelona. Rife hitting it on. Oh, and it's Oh, it's good. Has to go down. And the referee is giving a free kick to Leeds United. The whistles were resounding around this stadium. They thought for a moment he was pointing to the penalty spot. Wall not really ten yards back. Touched there by uh, Gallego for Rex Ash. And now Bremner can lead the charge to the other end. Got a wait for support. And Bremner getting caught up there with Gallego. And the referee... It's going to show a card, a yellow card, to Gallego. Well, he was guilty of one or two rather brutal challenges very early in the game, Gallego. And I think it's quite clear that the referee has got to take a very strong hand in this game. There have been one or two rather unpleasant things that have happened early on in this second half. Already is furious with the referee. I think he wants them to get Billy Bremner off the field and the Barcelona players are carrying him off and the Leeds United players are protesting and the referee has got to act strongly. Bremner still down. Barcelona want him off the field. Leeds want him on the field. Bremner back on. Hunter lost that one in the air. Rex Ash for Barcelona. Cruyff on the far side. Gray going out there and he committed himself and Cruyff got past it. Bremner went in hard on Cruyff and the crowd didn't like that. And the referee says that's got to be a free kick. By Billy Bremner. And so it's a free kick. Cruyff will take it. One of those free kick specials of his curling away. Oh, and a save, and a good one there by Stu on Miguelli. Rife with the kick to Gallego. Again, the ball hit high towards Marino, and Gordon McQueen was there. Rex Hush turning it in. Oh, and a great save again by David Stewart. Hit towards Trevor Cherry. Accurately headed there towards Lorimer. Heredia, flicked on again there, now will it come for Torres? Oh, and Chile's put it into trouble, and Stewart's got him out of 
Neskin's there first, but no advantage play for the free kick taken quickly. Here's Rex Ashworth across towards Troy. Good play by Cruyff again. De La Cruz coming in Heredia with the header. Rex Ash. Heredia. Four Barcelona players are there, so good. It's good. It comes to play a little bit. Head away by McQueen. There's a touch by Rex Ash. Pass down. No penalty. No, it wasn't, says the referee. And Della Cruz finally belted the ball over. And the Prussians are raining down all around me now. They claim there was a penalty. Cruyff trying to dink that in again. McQueen getting it away. And as the ball goes in again, well, was it? No, said the referee. Reef, Rex Ash with the shot and McQueen turning up one away for the corner. Leeds United then. Here's Gallego with the free kick, curling in there once again. Flores, yes! Flores has done it! And Leeds now under enormous pressure. As the cross came in, the number 11 headed it wide of Stewart. And Flores has scored for Barcelona. <laughs> 22 minutes to go now. And as I said a moment ago, if they get one, then Leeds are going to be under enormous pressure. And Barcelona are really going to pressurise them now. One more goal by Barcelona will take us into extra time. Two more goals will take Barcelona through. Now the crowd are really getting behind Barcelona. And the fight really is on for Leeds. And McQueen is in trouble. And McQueen is sent off. McQueen has been sent off for something that happened there. And now Leeds are in trouble. Well, the referee had no uh, doubts at all about it. We can see it again now. Yes, that was what caused Gordon McQueen to be sent off. Heredia. Neskin. Rife. Neskin. Leeds have pulled everybody bar Joe Jordan back now. And it's Cherry who only half gets it away. It comes to Clive. Clive for the shot. Oh, and what a save again by David Stewart. It's a corner. But what a tremendous piece of goalkeeping there by Stewart. Clive. Hit that well and true. Here he comes there. Great work. To Migueli. A whole action now. Centered almost entirely in this Leeds United half of the field as the ball comes in again towards Flores and again Norman Hunter is there for Leeds. Here's Naskin. There's the shot by Rex Hatch. It'll come back to Flores. Good go. It's only Frankie Gray, by the way. My oh my oh my. Well, Cruyff was right there, it seemed, on his own in the six-yard area or just outside it. As Barcelona hurl that corner in again, and again Norman Hunter gets it away for Leeds United. Gallego turning it back in again. He looks upside. Does he know? Oh, and again he's pushed away by Leeds. He's going to get there at last. The one place they wanted to be for so long, and that's it! Leeds United are in the European Cup final. They have saved themselves against a lot of pressure in the last 20 minutes when they conceded a goal by Clares. Tonight is also the Leeds United night. The final scoreline here in Barcelona. Leeds United 1, scored by Peter Lorimer. Barcelona 1, scored by Clares in the second half. Leeds go through to the European Cup final. Billy Bremner and his team go across to that band of Leeds United supporters who come all the way from Yorkshire for this moment. And it's on those sort of pictures that we, with great happiness, say goodnight to you all from Barcelona.